Arirang TV has just been made available on satellite TV across the United Kingdom. And um, you never get to make a second chance to make a first impression. So is Arirang TV making a lasting first impression on the UK public? Our Kim Jong-su went out to meet some himself. Arirang TV is transmitted to over a hundred countries around the world. But now it's taken a new step in the UK by being made available on Britain's local satellite networks. On September 26th, Arirang TV became available in UK households, including Emma Stock's home here in London. Emma, a fashion student, has been an avid fan of Korean culture for a number of years now. She had been watching Arirang online in the past, but now she is excited about the prospect of having it readily available in her living room in full HD. I think it's really cool because I can see like favorite actors, singers, um, there's a variety of different shows to watch. Arirang is now on two TV service providers in the UK, Sky and Freesat. Together, they are beamed into more than six million households. I think the excitement's beginning to build now. People are starting to hear about it, and I think it will be very, very popular on Freesat. Anticipation is high among those who already have an interest in Korea. New Malden, located in the suburbs of London, is home to some 20,000 Koreans, the largest Korean community in Europe. Among the local Korean restaurants, shops and businesses, I found Sebastian, a linguist who worked as a translator in Seoul. I used to watch Arirang TV before moving back to the UK. Uh, I think it's really great that now I can just, it's coming, up, it's coming at home, so now I can just go home, turn on the TV and I can have Arirang right there. Like that. And I think it's going to be really good to tell my other friends about it. But as well as bridging the gap for those who already have connections with Korea, there are high hopes that through informative and entertaining content, Arirang TV will be able to reach a new British audience. Kim Jong-soo, Arirang News.